Do we not make a bigger gun then? No. Oh. Not at the moment. Right, right. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh! Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Uh, in the previous video, we <laughs> tested four half-inch impact wrenches, yes, budget-friendly ones, and we even dunked them in water. We did. We mm -hmm. nearly killed them. But the quick question from a lot of our viewers were, did they still work after dunking them in that bucket of water? Well, Rich, what was the answer? Do they still work? I think they still do. You think they still do? So, right, let's try the cress. Still working. The kilda. Still going. The high undie. <laughs> Still going, but sounds rough. Oh. And Jeff, our Amazon special. Oh dear, Jeff. Oh dear. He's died. RIP Jeff. Sorry, mate, you're not working with us anymore. Right, so in our previous video, we had loads of comments from viewers asking us to do the same tests and probably even more with the big boys that are on the market. They did. So Josh put up a post on Instagram saying, what would you like to see the Milwaukee up against? Because we had this one already. We thought that's actually a great one to do it with. So we have three, three quarter inch impact wrenches. Now I've got the Makita because I'm the lover of blue in this three-way relationship that we've got. <laughs> <laughs> Speak for yourself. To be fair, yes, we feature a lot of red and black content, but Josh is Makita personal fan. Yes, even though James is donning the Makita top today. I am. I got. I got some <laughs> no, blue shirts. No logos, but you know. no. I've got the Cress Cub 35. I've got the Milwaukee M181 FHIWF 34. Yeah, because it's a really catchy name. That. Mm, definitely. And I forgot to mention mine was a DT DTW1001. And those two revised what their model numbers were, whereas I didn't. <laughs> but on mine, I am running the 6 amp hour Forge battery. Yeah, the new Milwaukee battery. So does look nice, that. That's does a nice looking battery. Nice looking battery. I'm running in a 4 amp hour battery. Yeah, and I'm running the 5 amp hour on the 18 volt system. Right. <laughs> While those two are fighting <laughs> over their pork swords. Oh, you can do it. Um, we did invite the yellow brand to be part of this because we had a few comments saying they wanted to see DeWalt, didn't they? Mm. But unfortunately, it has been radio silence from Dewalt. So pop it in the comments below. Tag Dewalt, tag Dewalt, tag Dewalt on our Instagram. Tag Dewalt, tag Dewalt. If you want to see yellow and black tools on our videos. You know any problem with that? What? We'll have to find a fourth presenter then. That's right. Well, no, we'll just go back to two presenters okay. and have yeah. two each. All right, bin him off. Yeah, bin Rich off. Cheers, thanks. <laughs> nice to be wanted. <laughs> <laughs> right, so the first test is to drive that coach bolt into a log. And we're going to time it on each one. What's your specs on your gun then, Rich? Fastening torque is 1700 and nut busting torque is 2100. And my nut busting torque is 1700 newton meters and the fastening torque is 1250 newton meters. Interesting, good revision there, guys. My fastening torque is 1627 newton meters and my nut busting torque is 2034 newton meters. Wow. So theoretically, Rich is, is claiming the biggest. I've got the biggest bad boy. What they would say? Small things come in big packages. Apparently so. <laughs> Will this 200 mil coach bolt go into this tree stump? Now, to keep it fair, James is going to do a time test. So we're going to start off all at the same time and we're going to drive it in. Three, two, one, go. Struggling to get his end on that. Right, right. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Did you break a nail? I just my finger. <laughs> that really hurt. Okay, to make it fair, I'm going to screw it into exactly the same ring as Josh has done. Two, one, go. Done. Same ring again with the Milwaukee A. Oh yes, let's do it. Go! Wow. Boom, baby. Oh yeah, boom. I win. I think you put all your weight through it, I think. I think it's that one, one nil, nil. <laughs> yeah. Right, and now time for some nut busting. Exactly what these tools are designed for. And I've got my beautiful Sammy tractor here, which in the previous video where we used the more budget options, some of them couldn't undo these nuts. So this is the proper test for these bigger guns. Right, so I'm going to try the Makita first and we're going to see if we can undo four 30mm nuts. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> oh, 
right? We got it in low. Hmm? It's going to explode if I push it anymore. You got two done. Now it's time for the crest. Go. Jesus. Three, but can do one more. <laughs> oh. 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 All right, leave that on there. <laughs> <laughs> so, right, this is not staged, I promise, because I know I'm a massive Milwaukee fan, but Josh is a massive Makita fan, so this is all 100% true and honest. So, I'm going to start with that one again, but that is the one that the crest wouldn't undo. Let's see if the Milwaukee can do it. Three, two, one, go. Boom, baby. Boom. <laughs> a bit higher than this one, though. No. This is the weakest one. Oh, the Makita is the weakest? All yeah. oh, right. I he's thought that was... No, he's only 1,700 Newton meters. Do they not make a bigger gun, then? No. Oh. Not at the moment. I, I think don't. he's making excuses. Is he no, Googling now to see if they make no, a bigger no. one? No, I just, no, I just... Le who, the her. Right, so it's now time to roll our sleeves up and probably the test that I am most nervous about doing. We're going to dunk them in the pond? In the fuck pond. it. <laughs> them in might the be a pond for you, mate. Yeah, to be fair, if they don't work afterwards, we could put, might as well put them in a the pond. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Although, saying it is a pond, Rich, have you got your life ring just in case you do fall in? <laughs> You're so funny. <laughs> right, let's do it. Sorry, Makita. Jesus Christ. I'm not even religious. Ready? Hello, darkness, my old friend. <laughs> oh. Dead. Done a thing. <laughs> is, that right. another, is that the new Jeff? Huh? He still works, oh. but All right. he's, a, he's a sprayer. Oh, let's dunk it. <laughs> She's a squirter, Rich. She is a squirter. Keep dunking her. Oh. Killed it. Oh, going no. go. oh, it's still going. One more. One more. Oh, mate. <laughs> Still yeah, one, going. One more for luck. Still working. Well, thanks to Rich, you know, squirting his crest everywhere. My Milwaukee's already got a damp outer casing. Let's um, roll up my sleeves and dunk her. Oh, oh. Did I leave oh, her under oh. there too long? Did I leave her under there too long? Oh, oh, there we go. Oh, you <laughs> dirty bastard! Come on, I ran right my face at this. Oh, no. Hang on. Hang on, it's gone right over the screen. Lens. Hang on. James. Thanks for wiping my lens, but that was. Oh, oh there, there oh, we go. Oh, here we go. Yeah, oh, oh, it's still going. Yeah. Oh. 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 <laughs> still going. Still good. But it's not. Not stopping it's sounding like It's sounding like an old electric drill from like the 1980s. Hmm, that's different. Anyway. <laughs> right now, I thought I was nervous about the water test. <laughs> Have you got the something to tell the viewers, James? Uh, my Milwaukee isn't currently working. Right? Oh. But by the time this video ends, oh. it's going to be working again. Yeah, what he's going right? to do is he's going to swap it in another box. Well, because, get it's, another one out. because it's so intelligent, right? It's yeah. just shutting itself down yeah. for, for now. It's just yeah. having a little sleep. Yeah. That's all it's doing. I know it's spitting with rain, James, but come on, your tool should work in this. 
It's fine. I think there's Jack and Nori's story. All right. Josh it's fine. It's, it's angry at me because I wore some blue on my jumper today. <laughs> right, anyway, moving on, we are on to the drop test. I think that's my favourite, actually. I know, I'm nervous. I, 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 I didn't mind doing it with the other tools when yeah. we've done it in the last test, but yeah. doing it with a M Milwaukee that doesn't work, it might bring it well, back to it life. Might do. It, it might, might be not a resuscitation be test. But to be honest with you, they're big, heavy heavy duty tools they should withstand i think they'll withstand it they should be fine yeah now we did drop it about sort of two and a half three meters last time but we got rich up there this time so we're only dropping it about a meter and a half <laughs> no i'm only joking <laughs> <laughs> anyway, right. so it's some fair height isn't it right the key, the key to, to go first <laughs> it's made a dent in the concrete josh do you want to see i'm gonna pick up his makita <laughs> it looks like it's intact the battery has ejected, but we are. Uh oh. <laughs> squeeze the trigger. Oh, Come on. Oh, squeeze the trigger. It's still, still working. Oh, look at him. Look at him. Look at that smile. He just uh, didn't want it. Oh, no, it. I think you're out of vibes, sort of. No, bit. that is meant to be like that. All right. <laughs> Time for the crest. Oh, God. Oh. God. Oh. You, chipped some, you chipped some concrete then, Rich. <laughs> you literally made a dent in the ground. <laughs> No, we're all safe, and the battery's still on it. Yay! <laughs> uh -oh. oh. No, it's meant to be <laughs> <laughs> Now time for the Milwaukee. You got your tissues ready, James? Oh. 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 She landed sideways. Oh. All right. Is she back to life, James? No, but to be fair, she looks better than all of the others. Because it's Milwaukee. It's <laughs> oh. still, still not working. Right, let's give it one more go. See if it works. Oh, James is going to be well happy. What's he take us for? Huh? They've been sabotaging my Milwaukee <laughs> because I went to pick it up again just then and it didn't work again. Took the battery out, put it back in, and it worked. So I reckon they put a bit of plastic over the end of the terminal. No, well, it was no. the battery one slid in. Yeah. Well, all it was. Right yeah. yeah. Mine's not even damaged. Saved itself. Yours isn't even damaged. I one thing I love about your two, you heard that right. That the Milwaukee hasn't got. They said Makita. That the Milwaukee hasn't got. It's <laughs> rubbing off on him, isn't it? <laughs> I, don't you, I don't want you rubbing off on me. <laughs> um, <laughs> <first>. <laughs> um, is that you both come with rubber ends over your end of your casting mm -hmm. or a casing mm -hmm. on the end, whereas the Milwaukee doesn't. I know Milwaukee supply like the rubber boots you can put over them, which make them look hideous. Um, but you can get them. But I do like that you've got that as standard on yeah, yours. Yeah, you have got a little scratch there. Right? I have. I have got a scratch. You yeah, have. I have. And here, but now it looks like it's been used. And the other thing with the Makita as well, it's got that anti-vibration system on it, so it probably did protect the, the bottom end a little bit, really. Sure, it's not broken. No, yeah, yeah, it's it's not broken. Have that no, much movement. No, I've... So what does that do then? Talk, talk us through that. Huh? What does that do? Uh, well, it's anti-vibration. But what's that? It's not the bit that's vibrating. You're holding on to the bit that's vibrating, surely. Uh, well, yeah, but it protects any force if you were to drop it on the floor, you see. And I've got one exactly the same as this, but I've got a half inch version. And mine's exactly the same as that. It's a, it's a good feature. No, 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 yeah. no, it's protecting the battery from vibration, yeah. not your hands. No, it's protect, it? probably protecting the base yeah. from any knocks or drops. Anyway, you're going to try a socket on, see so if that actually fits. Yes. So we did struggle when, I first, when we first put them on before, didn't we? Yeah. It's, it's, it's tight, isn't it? It is tight. It is tight. But precision, perhaps. <laughs> Mind you, check, don't break your ribs doing it, Rich. Like that, Milwaukee. <laughs> he says. <laughs> 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 well, should just, we just see if that slips on the Makita? <laughs> <laughs> there you are. There you are. Yeah, who's laughing yeah, now, slack. eh? Slack. Who's laughing now? Slack, Alice, look, look, look. look. <laughs> <laughs> slack on there. There he is, come on. Hey. Yeah. Crass, spec wise, mm -hmm. comes out showing the most. Powerful machine, mm -hmm. yeah. and then it's Milwaukee, yeah. and actually Makita comes out with a less, less like, spec. So, well, so on the track, the nut test, obviously, you know, we just someone was looking test. a little bit sad about that. No, <laughs> they were just in the back. Just, and Josh, Josh is there. Was it one nut? I've had to, I had to speed up the video. I haven't done the edit yet, but I'm going to have to because he's he's there going. Ooh, it will do it. <laughs> what must have been what felt like 15 minutes. Yeah, on I didn't one realise nut. I was on the soft setting. Yeah, it's right. <laughs> Yeah, the excuses are coming now. Mm. Um, but they're certainly good tools, aren't they? Uh, yes. Yeah. And they to be fair, yeah, they are all great. The um, that saying it's more powerful than that. It's not. No. Prove that. Yeah. But it's still very powerful. Very, very powerful. And that is well. I think a half inch will be fine for that, yeah. wouldn't it? 
And that and that gun there has probably been around for several years, I reckon. Yeah, well, it takes Makita about 10 years to develop one tool at a time, doesn't it? So, whereas Milwaukee are pouring out about 50 a month. <laughs> You're excited about that, aren't you? Oh. There we are. Right, we're going to get a really big bowl of rice and put them in. But thank you very much for watching. We're Machinery Nation. We bring you tool and machinery videos every single week. Hopefully they'll be as fun as this one next time. So we'll see you soon. Cheerio! Cheerio.